Welcome everyone to this video. In this video we'll be looking at selections and how to make artworks like this using just selections. It's gonna be a really fun one so let's just get right into it. So let's start with going to the selection tool. So this is the selection tool and if you right click on it you'll get options. So the ones that we'll discuss are the rectangular marquee tool and the elliptical marquee tool. So we'll be going to be using elliptical marquee tool for this project. So let's just click on it and then just make a selection the same way you make any shape. So just leave your mouse and here you go. You've made your first selection in Photoshop. So what are the uses of selection? So for example, let's just say I've made a selection and I want this part of the image to be darker. So I've made a selection and then I can go to levels and then increase the darkness or the brightness of just this part. Here you can see and the second use of a selection can be to make a copy of a selected area of an image and that's what we are going to do right now for this project. So before making a selection make sure you hit shift to make a perfect selection then you can place it wherever you want I'm just gonna place it right here and then hit Control and J or just right click and duplicate and Control J is just a keyboard shortcut for duplicating so here you can see nothing happened but if you see the layers you can see there's a whole new layer and if I turn off this layer, you can see that we have a copy of that part. So now let's move this image into that document. Drag, drag, drag here and then leave. Now we have this copy of the leaf image. And now we'll hit Control T to transform. And then we'll just hit Shift to decrease its size. And then just according to your image just scale it now i'm not holding shift i'm just moving these handles to see what will be the appropriate size so we're just gonna fit this image into the cup like this something like this and just click on this tick mark or hit enter so basically it's done and we're gonna do another thing so here you can see that around whoops so around the cup we have like an orange reflection or highlight kind of thing on the cup but our image is green so what can we do so we can make another selection by going to selection tool or the better way will be hitting down control and then clicking on this layer and here you can see it will give us the selection of the object so here we have the selection of the circular cutout of the leaf image and then we're gonna increase the size of the selection how do we do that we're gonna go to select whoops my battery is running low so just go to select modify and then expand and then you can expand by 30 pixels i've done it and 30 pixel is working so just 30 pixels so here you can see it is now covering that area of where the orange like reflection is and now what we're gonna do is just go here and then vibrance and then we're gonna decrease the vibrance so there will not be any like orange highlight here so here you will see that the picture's vibrance is also decreasing and that is because this layer is above the picture so we're just gonna move the vibrance layer below and here you can see the image vibrance is now saved and we have decreased the vibrance of the cup so there's no more orange like reflection there's still some and we can decrease it with color balance but We've not done it in the lesson or the course yet. So for now, this was it for selections.